PB and J. You know what I mean? Jelly tots. Oh, British right? snacks? Yeah. What the fuck? Like kids. How would you say that? In a Have you ever had a banana and Nutella toast? Yes. I'm too f poor for PB and J. What? Bro. <laughs> Dog. Dude, listen. Okay. Here's what I'm going to say. Okay. They aren't wrong? Bro, come on. It, it's literally... What, what, you're on Twitch. That's wild. Like, I feel like by virtue of being on Twitch, uh, you know, you're, you're probably clearing the peanut butter jelly uh, financial, financial, like, uh, entry level, okay? It's like saying you're, you're too poor for just... You know, toast, like bread. Like, what are you eating? Dirt sandwiches? Like, the fuck? It makes no goddamn sense to me. In a lilting English accent. Jelly tots. Jelly tots. <laughs> <laughs> I love how subtly you said it. Perfect. Jelly tots. This shit's going to be trash, dude. I mean, this isn't even about, like, Steve Carell or whatever. I just want to see, like, British snacks. They're going to be awful. British people eat, like, licorice and shit, don't they? It's nasty. Hello, this is Steve Carell, and this is Snack Wars UK versus USA on Lad Bible. We're doing I mean, I like Snack Steve Carell. I'm just UK saying, like... versus USA because I am from the USA. And I'm going to look at the UK snacks as compared to the USA snacks, determine which Mr. one. Mr. One Million House Lectures the Poor on Eating Disconnected. Bro, I am. Like, you know, I am I am very disconnected, but like not disconnected enough to, to fucking go for you trolling in the chat when you say I'm too poor for peanut butter and jelly. You know what I mean? Like, you're right. But I think if I went about, if I... <laughs> If I if I literally let that shit fly in the chat, that would be way more disconnected. Okay. Come on. You know, you get the fucking store brand peanut butter and you get the store brand jelly like and and toast is the cheapest thing you can get, pretty much the cheapest kind of, kind of bread you can get at the fucking store. Like you're out of your mind. You're making like hundreds of snacks off of like one tub of peanut butter and one tub of jelly. That's insane. Like you're, I don't even know how to. I don't even know how to calculate it. I like. No one really cares, but I'm gonna say it anyway. <laughs> Motherfuckers would be like, oh. Mother "Oh Jesus, okay, well, clearly, fucking the the oh, oh, okay. strawberry too. This, That's my yeah. shit." <laughs> I didn't even yeah. know Marmite it was is not Uber, winning this. But the the swirl, the peanut butter jelly swirl. I uh, I'm a big peanut butter and jelly fan. I actually had a peanut butter and jelly sandwich this last. Uh, before I got on the plane to come here, because really? I wasn't sure whether I was going to be eating on the plane, so I had a peanut butter and jelly sandwich. Yep, you know, that's pretty great. There's another component you can add, n not commonly done in the United States, but I like to do it, is put peanut butter jelly and uh, fluff, the um, like oh. marsh the marshmallow <laughs> fluff. We have it. You do? That's exact right. Do you want a nut? <laughs> wow. That is what I call service. Um, oh, and it's fresh. Yeah, I do yeah. this. Yeah, I highly recommend this because, you know what? <laughs> Peanut butter and jelly just isn't sweet enough, a sandwich. So, what the oh, fuck? Here we go. A little okay, bit of fluff on the top. Okay, he's crazy. He's crazy. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. 
That's a complete meal. <laughs> That's it's he's a, so American as with my it. My mom would say, "It's all protein." <laughs> um, this, it's pronounced Marmite, right? I don't. When you see yeast, the word yeast on a label, <laughs> it doesn't naturally lead you to think of delicious eating, but. He, bro, he bit the toast. No. He okay. literally bit just mostly toast. <laughs> oh, wow. Okay, I've never. <laughs> rich, rich in B vitamins. <laughs> and it's vegan. <laughs> So two, two great things going for it. I'm gonna stick with my PB and J. Oh, wow! I guess I don't have to close my eyes before I take it off because I can't see it. You told me, you told, you told me to close my eyes. So this, this whole thing does. How long have you been doing this show? Okay. Oh, okay. Here we go. This would be your traditional, original beef jerky. Always, always good on a road trip, you know, when you don't want to stop. And if you want to gross out everybody else who's in the car with you, because it really, it's very pungent in an enclosed space. You can probably smell it already. Well, that's just good. Beef jerky is delicious. Scratchings. Hell yeah, let's go. Chatter did the math. Going off of serving size, size stats, the average peanut butter and jelly sandwich costs 24 cents. Bourgeois decadence, dude. Some of us don't have 24 cents on a sandwich, okay? I'm literally eating air. How dare you? You, If you were less, if you were less out of touch, you would know that many of us are just eating air sandwiches right now. <laughs> Mist <laughs> I love it. I love the brand name, Mr. Porky. <laughs> Is this a very common brand name? Yeah. I've never, I've never sampled any of Mr. Porky wares. <laughs> Porky's, oh. Are these like pork rinds? Kind of, yeah. It's Yum. just pork fat, fat isn't it? It's just fat. Yeah. It's <laughs> <laughs> Okay. That might be better than the beef jerky, but also, like, that's a crazy thing to eat. Like, beef jerky is actually very healthy. That's just pork fat. That's insane. <laughs> that, you made it sound <laughs> that much better. <laughs> no, no, see, you look at it, and it's Mr. Porky, and there's Mr. Porky on the, on, he, that's him, and he looks so excited and happy and they're called scratchings which is cute and then you say it's just fat <laughs> all right oh oh that's so gross <laughs> <laughs> um all right i don't want to get into trouble with the porky company but this is that's that's not for me i would i would stick with this Oh boy. It's really smooth. Oh. <laughs> oh boy. Sit bucket. <laughs> when you want deep fried pork fat, <laughs> finish it off with a Dr. Pepper Zero. Jelly tots. Jelly tots and toxic waste. What the fuck is a toxic waste? See, that's, that's what's so wonderful about it. This is that you can't open it. Does it have <laughs> like a? <laughs> I literally have no. I've never seen that. Thanks. And each bag includes its own pair of scissors. <laughs> <laughs> um. Oh, and they're individually wrapped. <sighs> By it's that's a, a workout. How to get into? So these are like hard candy. Mm -hmm. That, oh, that's horrible. Wow. No, no, no. Nope. Nope. There's, I can't leave this one in my mouth. Thank you.
Oh Sorry. my god. <laughs> Just describe the time. Wow! <laughs> wow. No, that. <sighs> wow. That just gets worse and worse. The more you suck on it. Sour's, sour's fine, but that's ridiculous. <laughs> oh, those are good. Mm. Up to friendly little candy. <laughs> yeah. Jelly tots, right? Yeah, like kids. How would you say that in, jelly, a, in a lilting English accent? Jelly tots. Jelly tots. Jelly tots, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Very nice. <laughs> I love how subtly you said it. <laughs> Perfect. Jelly toss. <laughs> jelly toss in it. All 500 of them. Better than fucking jelly deals, <laughs> right? Good. You don't Iron know. Oh. Mountain Dew. Oh, I've had both. I like, I like this. I've had both. I know a lot of people are going to say Arm Brew, but. No. If there's one thing that America does best, it's disgusting soda, okay? I'm sorry. No disrespect to the boys overseas, okay? But we have our soda shit on lock, okay? We are the nation of soda boys. And the reality is that, uh, you know, Mountain Dew is the probably one of the most uh, incredible tasting, undisputed champions. Now... He's currently in the UK. So the Mountain Dew that he's drinking is not going to have the original chemical flavors. So I don't know what the fuck he's drinking, really. You're the only person I've ever seen drink Mountain Dew? Really? Bi coastal elite ass audience, bro. Mountain Dew is literally the fucking beverage of the proletariat, dude. The uh, rhyme there. I went through a Mountain Dew phase. I've never I had was... it. What does it taste like? You've never had Mountain yeah. Dew? Um, it tastes like a... A yellow ray of sunshine. <laughs> Good. He's right. And this is. Are you going? It, Have you heard of it before? I've never had it. Okay, so it's the drink of Scotland. Okay. And they love it, and it's orange. So it's haggis soda. Exactly. Okay. <laughs> oh, I like that a lot, actually. Yeah, really? I think that's delicious. Yeah, it has a. <laughs> Yeah, I, I like it. I like I like how it lingers on the tongue. I can't believe I'm talking about it like I'm <laughs> <laughs> like I'm a wine connoisseur. <laughs> talking to, talking about the varietal characteristics of Mountain Dew as a um, so it's Iron Brew. Yeah. Um, I like this better. Oh great. Yeah, delicious. Cool. All right. Wrong. Space Raiders. Pickled onion. Ooh. What? All right. These are the American, right? No, it's the English. These are English? Oh, TGI. <laughs> <laughs> TGI Friday. Okay, I'll have those. Bro, a TGI Friday branded bag of potato chips or whatever the fuck that is. That is so British, dude. That's not an American snack. I've never seen that. Like, we have, we have TGI Fridays, like, uh, frozen meals and shit, but do they even have like branded snacks? Like that, I don't think that's literally in America. I think you can get a frozen meal. Oh, you have seen them? Every Midwestern gas station, you've never been outside then? The only thing I've seen from TGI Fridays is uh, frozen meals. I've never seen the snacks. So second, party bites, mac and, mac and cheese party bites. It's not a party. Oh, these are like just, yeah, they're like cheese puffs. Yeah, oh, that sounds good. They're, they're not bad, yeah. Corn, corn, cheesy. Yeah. Yeah. Cheesy goodness. 
These aren't, this isn't fried fat again, is it? <laughs> okay. I'm gonna say the Space Raiders. Really? Yeah, they, they have more flavor to them. Those are good. I like those. The, oh, nice. the pickled onion, let's, uh, who wants to kiss? <laughs> <laughs> well, I think that was maybe a trouble. Was that really? Yeah. I didn't do that intentionally. I think the UK one. Oh, the UK one. Sorry, UK apologies. UK one. All right. Well, but for the purposes of the edit, we'll do a reaction to both. <laughs> I want. That's disgusting. That actually is insane. I I don't understand. <laughs> Turn my lips into a cat's asshole. <laughs> Holy <laughs> shit. UK food blows. Oh! 